I believe that it must be the policy of the United States to support free peoples who are resisting attempted subjugation if we falter in our leadership. We may endanger the peace of the world, and we shall surely endanger the welfare of this nation. Hello, this is True North, the news source so trusted, people often ask it to babysit their children. I'm MC2 Mick Domestico. And I'm MC2 Tyler Caswell. Welcome to our Navy Birthday Celebration Edition. This week we'll see how Truman celebrated the Navy's 238th birthday, and we'll check in with our crew to see how our underway PFA is going. We'll also sit down with our most renowned guest to date, sorry all previous guests, and we'll hear how you think our modern Navy compares to that of the Continental Navy. But first, let's take a look back at all that makes us so great. A celebration of our bonds of affection, as a great man once said. Happy birthday, U.S. Navy from the Supply Department on board USS Harry S. Truman. Give them hell. Although it may be easy to forget sometimes, we're all in this together. 
It's our ability to work together that makes us such an effective fighting force. I agree. It's the relationships we develop here that breathe life into our collective experience. While we're on the topic of experiences we enjoy so much, the fall PFA is well underway. While we're underway. Truman sailors are deviating slightly from the norm by conducting a physical fitness assessment while deployed. MC3 Lorenzo John Burleson weighs in on the story. Sailors aboard aircraft carrier USS Harry S. Truman commenced the 2013 Second Cycle Physical Readiness Test September 6th during its 2013 deployment. Uh, it's equally important, even with Perside NOB Norfolk, it's a requirement set by the Navy, we do the PRT twice a year. So it's a part of the uh, culture of fitness that the Navy trying to establish. Although deployed ships have the option of waiving the biannual PRT, Truman proceeded with the assessment as usual. Physical fitness is very important. Um, us doing the PRT underway when it's normally waived is, uh, is a sign that this command takes physical fitness at the utmost importance. The PRT is conducted throughout the Navy in the spring and fall of each year aboard USS Harry S. Truman. I'm Petty Officer Lorenzo John Burleson. Happy birthday, Navy, from USS Harry S. Truman. I submit that it's our unwavering dedication to excellence that makes us so great. What is it that makes you so great? Well, we're about to find out in a new segment dreamed up by the one, the only, QM1 Jupiter Jack Johnson called How Great Is Your Ring? What's going on, camera? Hey, Truman. I met you Schmidt down here in security. You comfortable? Like CD Serta Pasha Peter comfortable? I'm comfortable. You know why you're comfortable? Because I got the watch and maze. We had to watch for 200 plus years when the oldest rates in the Navy. Originally, we started off by training tactics, defensive movements, and weapons on board ships. Funny thing is, we still do. Hey, boss, let me get it done. Clearly safe. Hey, stand by to stand by. I got guns here. So, let me think. Me as the anti trainer, anti terrorism training supervisor, my job specifically is taking what you would say uh, a human lump of clay, a oh, non rated yeah. MA. Here. Hey, yo. He's with the man. Let's go. So uh, like I was saying, my job specifically, taking a lump of clay, training them into uh, depend upon to defend the ship. Now, us as MAs, we're also in charge of the weapons program. We teach defensive tactics, we also teach the weapons, we also teach uh, self-defense of the ship. Now, pretty much makes us gods amongst mere mortals, but hey, what's going on? So, like I was saying, Next time you guys want to test security, rain or shine, law enforcement every time. Have no fear though, the MAs are here. Oh, and before I forget, how great is your rate? Shipmates, October 13th is the Navy birthday. That means it's our birthday. What, a, what an honor it is to serve. And to you and to the Navy, I say, happy birthday. Well, ladies and gentlemen, start your engines and prepare to defend your rate's honor. Each week, we'll be on the hunt to answer the age-old question of whose rate is truly the greatest. A question sailors have been asking since the inception of the Navy. In fact, this week marks the 238th birthday of the Navy. Really? I swear, it doesn't look a day over 230. Truman sailors celebrated the Navy's birthday this week with, yes, you guessed it, another kick cutting on the mess decks. I went down to get the scoop. They had ice cream, too. Good afternoon, everybody, and happy birthday. 
Sailors and Marines aboard USS Harry S. Truman celebrated the Navy's 238th birthday while deployed to the U.S. Fifth Fleet Area of Responsibility. I have the honor and privilege of working with the finest men and women our country has to offer. This was the case 238 years ago and remains as true today as it was at our Navy's inception. While celebrating the Navy's birthday, Truman's crew members remember the sacrifices of prior service members who helped shape the Navy as we know today. Sailors in the past, they've been in my spot. They were all new at once. They built their way to make this great Navy that we have now. I'm new and I hope to be as great as they all once were. As per tradition, the oldest and youngest sailors shared the first piece of the Navy's birthday cake. Aboard USS Harry S. Truman, I'm Petty Officer Tyler Caswell. Happy birthday, Navy, from everybody on the Harry S. Truman. Go Navy!